Let's take a minute. Just say thank you. For surviving that one mission! <laughs> Electric cars, while they're not exactly new, they're still kind of misunderstood by some. Some people think they're not as fast as patrol cars. Some people think they're just not practical. I'm Hanley and we're going 101 into electric driving. To dive into it a little bit more, we'll be checking out electric cars, calling in the help from the Bamba brothers. Earl and Will are professional race car drivers from New Zealand, and they'll be helping me just get to the bottom of everything today. So what's gonna happen is I'm gonna be seating a passenger side. Going You're brave, did you bring <laughs> a helmet? Or I like do have some helmet. pillows or padding or what? I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little nervous. I wouldn't sit next to him oh by my myself. God. Likewise, <laughs> not the same. Will is a racing driver, a coach, instructor, and designer. Earl's a highly accomplished race driver who ranks among the world's most elite of athletes. So what are your thoughts on electric driving? I think it's a common fear that everyone thinks they're slow and boring, but this has 680 horsepower, so it's got <laughs> phenomenal power. For me, honestly, I haven't driven that many. Yeah, last time I was driving it was in uh, Portugal a few weeks ago. Unfortunately, we were just doing shuttles back and forth, so we didn't really get to push it, so excited. I'm getting really psyched to try this out myself. Who wants to go first? Ooh, that's a good <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. Right, right. Let's go. Hold up. Everyone buckled up. Yes. Safety first. All right. Perfect. Shall we cruise? Do I need to hold on? I think no, we just go. enjoy it. It's quiet, you can't hear a thing. Well, it is really silent right now. This is very smooth. I snuck up on uh, the Porsche members the first time I drove and they didn't even hear the car coming. Oh, it's incredible. Nice. You can hear as you increase the throttle, this wind up the noise and the sound of the electric motor. I've made it really organic, sounding like a sports car still. It's still in there. That you can be cruising, there can be no sound, and then all of a sudden it turns into the sports car that That's it is. That's so cool. Every time we change these modes, the car is completely changing the way it handles, it feels. How is the handling actually? Everything about this car is surprising me. I thought it was going to be fake, and stiff and, and uh, not comfortable to drive. And when we got to that point and driving fast, which you might feel in a second, right now. <laughs> I know, I'm so nervous. <laughs> We're ready? All right. Oh I don't trust you guys. You don't, you don't trust, trust me? Don't Come on. Ah! Screaming's gone now at least. I know, yeah. right? Oh man! It's perfectly controlled everywhere. Oh, Stops well, turning well. But the control I have of the car is just fantastic. This car is unbelievable. Oh, man. Heart racing. What's the fastest you've been? 110? No, really? come on. Come on, it's more than that. <laughs> Sorry, oh, no. sorry, what, what, you really what, what, had to do that, <laughs> didn't you? Wow. We made it. That oh was amazing, God. but I think I need to try it. Let's, let's go again. Let's, no, let's, <laughs> let's switch. Let me swap. Oh, I don't want to go in the back. Let's go. <laughs> All right, let's Earl, see how much, your turn. Let's see how much power he uses. So starting a little slower, how are you feeling about it so far? What's really cool is it seems like a giant gentle beast, but then all of a sudden it's something like amazing. <laughs> Definitely a sports car still. And they try and hear this when, when it when it really kicks off the first time. It actually does change gear. Mm -hmm. It's very unique for EV cars. It's okay. Like, it's the first car to have actually a gearbox. Yeah. It's got that responsiveness. It looks like mundane from the outside. We're all having an amazing time in an EV car doing sporty dynamic stuff, which I think is something really cool that Porsche has managed to integrate into an EV car, and I think definitely busts every myth that EV cars are absolutely, slow. Absolutely, absolutely. Blew all the myths out of the water. Yeah. The car is impressive. We can try launch control. Why don't we try that? Okay, so I've been doing some research, you guys, for the turbo. The official time that it's gone is 3.2. That's quick. For an electric car that's, that's accessible to the public, that is an insane speed. Okay, let's go to the starting position. Okay. If I line up, okay. like really well in his tire tracks. All right. You ready? Three, 
Make sure we have the same starting position because this is competitive. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> go! Stop it already! I, did, I, did, I, did. I don't understand how something so quiet, so gentle oh, turns into such a again. weapon. How was that for you? Well, I think it's one of the quickest cars zero to 100 in the world. Also what was amazing just now is that we managed to repeat the launch controls like over and over again. And what we saw just now is exactly that DNA that they're built very, very tough. Well, I think what's really amazing with, uh, with EV cars in general is this juxtaposition of having something that's sustainable and then also having incredible instant performance. To have something that's environmentally based, soft, you know, caring about the environment, to then have so much performance is something that actually really excites me about the future of EV cars. So, as far as myths go for electric car... Busted. 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 Now I see you guys kind of like being anxious. You're like, yeah, okay, like, yeah, but we want to yeah. know who won. Like, according <laughs> to my violent. statistics, the winner is Will. Oh, got it. <laughs> Fair play. Fair play. Well, well I'm going to go drive because well, I lost. Gonna... <laughs> I lost, so I need some yeah, practice. So I'm out of here. Oh. Shake and bake. So I'm not gonna lie, you guys, I'm still feeling quite the rush from all that energy. We managed to bust out all the myths. Electric driving is more than just speed. You know, you can let go of this idea that you need to compromise. You can have luxury, you can have performance, and you can do all of this whilst being sustainable. So really, you have no more excuses. Coming for another ride. Ready? You back? Let's go again. Oh, <laughs>